The Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors has solicited the support of the House of Representatives in addressing the challenges bedeviling the medical profession in Nigeria. This followed the meeting of the association with the Speaker of the House of Representatives in Abuja. While briefing the Speaker, the National President of NARD, Dr. Emeka Innocent Oji, said the meeting was informed by the need to further solicit the support of the House in stemming the trend of brain drain in Nigeria, noting that over 2,000 doctors have left the country in search of better welfare in other countries within the last two years, while about 800 left within the last eight months, noting that the salary structure had been in existence for over 10 years and it is due for a review. Dr. Oji also pleaded with the leadership of the House to look into the issue of exchange programs to enable Nigerian doctors acquaint themselves to modern medical equipment in foreign countries. The association thereafter pledged the commitment of the new leadership to continue to partner with the House in order to address the challenges in the medical sector. As is expected, we have many challenges under the association, and it is our belief that with your usual and highly valued support, we will be able to surmount these challenges. Some of these challenges include the effect of brain drain on the medical workforce and the consequent burnout syndrome suffered by our mem members. And we were never in doubt as to the enormity of the issues we have at hand. But as professionals, we went ahead to commission several studies in order to be able to get the statistics that we can present before the government to know exactly what we are dealing with. So it will be interesting to note that we found out from those studies that in the last two years, over 2,000 resident doctors left this country. And we are talking about resident doctors that uh, we have another number of uh, close to 10,000 and 2,000 left in the last Indeed, in the last eight months, about 800 left. And this is what we went ahead to find out the root causes of this immigration that we are seeing. We discovered that 80% of the, of the reason why our members are living is because of poor remuneration. Yes, we know that uh, in terms of insecurity and poor working environment, they also asserted that these are contributing factors. But 80% of them, Responding, the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajabia Mila, commended the association for its effort in the medical sector despite the paucity of funds. The Speaker pointed out that the House will look at the 2023 budget for health sector and see how some amendments can be done, adding that the exchange program will also be looked into and proper advice will be given to the federal government on that regard. You have addressed so many so many uh, most of them we try to try and address as best as we can. You talk about brain dead brain and you gave some very scary figures in the last two years two thousand people have left, doctors have left. In the last uh, I remember you correctly eight months about eight hundred in the average is about hundred uh, hundred per month. And that's not a uh, very encouraging for a country of uh, over 200 million people to have the core of the medical team, the young ones, the resident doctors, uh, living in growth like that, is, uh, definitely something must be wrong. And you have identified that to be the issue of uh, emoluments and salaries. And uh, that's always a very important issue. What you must get paid, you must get paid in itself. But we, so it's also important that we put those things in context in terms of whilst we, everybody needs to get paid, and that's very important, we call it as a kind of business and not just for the right work that we don't have problems to take care of. But we'll put it in the right context in terms of the revenue and ability to have a country. Now, this is a worldwide phenomenon right now, it's going down. In Abuja, I am Ahmed Hassan Ahmed reporting for DITV World News.